My name is Anna, and I'm a second year PhD student here in the School of Medicine. Today, I'm going to tell you a little bit about my PhD research. So, when you think of your immune system, what's the first thing that comes to mind? Probably, for most of you, fighting foreign pathogens, bacteria, maybe COVID-19. But did you know that our immune system is highly adept at hunting down and killing cancer cells? That's right. Our immune system is our body's personal army that will fight for you, even if your own body is turning against you. In cancer, a tumor is a battlefield. The immune cells are constantly trying to get in there to recognize and to kill the cancer cells. However, the cancer cells are constantly trying to evade this immune response. And the major question for scientists has been, how does this happen? With our increased understanding of cancer, we found out that one way that they do this is by releasing tiny particles known as extracellular vesicles. EVs are nanoparticles. Nano just referring to their size because they're only a couple of nanometers in diameter. They contain messages encoded by their parent cell, that is the cell that releases them. An easy way to think of them is kind of like a cell's ID card, whereby they will contain a little bit of information about that cell. Cells use EVs to communicate with each other. However, cancer cells hijack this communication mechanism, sending harmful messages to the immune cells, basically telling them to go away and to die. My project is hoping to decode these messages that the cancer cells are sending and to see whether these messages can be intercepted. In the lab, we have a way of growing cancer cells known as culturing the cells. I can then isolate the EVs from these cultures. I can also isolate EVs from the blood of cancer patients. I then go on to characterize these EVs, basically decoding the messages that they carry. I also treat various kinds of immune cells with the EVs to see how the immune cells respond and how it affects their function. So that's all well and good, but why is this research important? Well, cancer, unfortunately, touches many people's lives. I'm sure a lot of you sitting here today either know somebody with cancer or maybe you've experienced it yourselves, which means there is constantly a need for new therapies. Immunotherapy has been such a massive breakthrough in the field of cancer research and has helped to save many, many lives. However, even the most popular immunotherapies do not have a 100% response rate across all cancer types, with some cancers being completely resistant to it, which means there's still that gap in our understanding of how the immune system interacts with the cancer. My project hopes to bridge that gap at least a little bit so we can continue making breakthroughs that save people's lives. Thank you very much.